Top 7 Best Motherboard for Ryzen 9 5 in 2022 Through extensive research and testing, I have put together the list of options that will meet the need of different types of buyers. So whether it's price, performance, or particular use, we have got you covered. For more information, I have put links of products in the description. Make sure to check it out. Like the video, comment, don't forget to subscribe, and let's get started. Number 7. Asus Prime X570P There are X570 motherboards out there that don't cost too much like the Prime X570P from Asus. It's more of a standard board with little in terms of flashy design and advanced features, but you still get one fine board with metal VRM heatsinks, PCIe 4.0 support, and high-quality components. Number 6. Gigabyte X570i Aorus Pro Wi-Fi Our last pick for the best motherboards for Ryzen 9 5950X is the Gigabyte X570i Aorus Pro Mini ITX. This one is a bit unique because of its small Mini ITX form factor. It packs all the power of your standard X570 motherboard into a small form factor motherboard for those who want to fit this into their mini build. Saying that it's as good as the previously mentioned X570 motherboard might be a bit of an overstatement. However, with a size of 1717 com, there's a nice balance between size, power, design, and overall features. As for the VRM, it has eight direct phases, six plus two. These are 70 amps phases, which means the power delivery should be more than enough even for the most demanding CPU like the Ryzen 9 5950X. It should also be able to overclock it to some extent. To be able to run a CPU of this caliber with a form factor like this is what makes this different from other mini ITX motherboards. Number 5. Asus ROG Crosshair Roman 8 Dark Hero Next up on the list is Asus ROG Crosshair Roman 8 Dark Hero. While the name is a bit of a stretch, it is a premium motherboard that is compatible with the Ryzen 5000 series right out of the box. There's a massive heatsink on top of the motherboard. There's also another heatsink underneath the ice slash o shield. Both of the heatsinks are connected with the heat pipe to help with dissipation, and Asus has also used a thermal pad which helps in further lowering the temperatures. The power delivery was the main focus for this motherboard. With the Dark Hero, Asus has improved the power delivery while maintaining low temperatures, which results in better overclocking. The Dark Hero has a 14 plus 2 VRM with 90 amp power stages. The addition of good cooling with a great power delivery makes this motherboard perfect for overclocking. This feature-packed motherboard is best suited for overclocking and will mostly support anything that you throw at it. Number 4. MSI MAG B550 Tomahawk Gaming Like its predecessor, the MSI B450 Tomahawk Max, the B550 Tomahawk Max from MSI also provides the best features for the chipset it supports, which is why it has been listed as the best B550 motherboard you can currently buy for the 5950X. The B550 Tomahawk Max Gaming is an excellent pick for a value B550 motherboard. It features a 10 plus 2 plus 1 face power design which is an upgrade from the previous generations. The heat sinks over the power delivery extend over the ice slash o area which not only makes them effective but also add a lot to the design of the motherboard. The extended heatsink is also one of the main reasons this motherboard provides such excellent value in this price category. The VRM is exceptionally good, considering this is in the B550 range. With a 10-phase, 60 of power output, and a beefy heatsink, it stays cool even under stress. With the inclusion of PCIe Gen 4, this is a huge step up from the previous generation of this motherboard, particularly when it comes to storage. The rear i slash o has an excellent selection of ports with 2x USB 3.2 Gen 1 ports and 2 USB 3.2 Gen 2 ports, which are always nice. Along with that, it has a 2.5 gigabit Ethernet port and another 1 gigabit Ethernet port. While the inclusion of 2 LA ports doesn't make sense here, any additional ports are always welcome. That's about it for the rear i slash o. Number 3. Asus ROG Strix B550A Next up on the list is the beautifully designed Asus ROG Strix B550A. With a solid mix of aesthetics and features, the ROG Strix B550 150A is overall one of the best white motherboards for Ryzen 9 5950X based on M4 chipset. You can buy to date. Asus's ROG Strix B550 uses the AMD B550 chipset and has a very unique look to it. 
It's for those looking for an aesthetically pleasing motherboard that matches the color scheme of their build while also doing its job as a high-quality motherboard. The VRM consists of 12 power stages for the CPU and 2 power stages for the RAM, which is decent for overclocking a less power-hungry CPU. But I would not get my hopes up for overclocking a 5950X or even a 5900 using this motherboard. It also includes premium alloy chokes and capacitors, allowing for better tolerance. It has two M2 slots, the first one being PCIe 4.0, while the other one is a PCIe 3.0, which is just perfect. The rear i/o panel consists of 1x Display Port, 1x HDMI port, 2x USB 2.0, 4x USB 3.2G, and one type of ports, along with a 1x USB 3.2 Gentro Type C port. As far as external connectivity goes, the rear i/o consists of a wire 2.5 gigabit LAN. Number two. MEG X570 Unify. The MEG X570 is a 6 PCB layered ATX motherboard, which is exactly something you would want in a PCIe 4.0 motherboard. It is a high end motherboard, and it is clear how much effort MSI has put into engineering this motherboard. It's for people that are looking for the latest and greatest for their CPU. The highlight of the MEG X570 Unify is the cooling solution a massive heatsink linked with a copper wire for better heat transfer. The cooling solution is made of metal, making it one of the most heat-efficient motherboards available. The VRM implementation on the MEG X570 Unified is far better than the one seen on other MSI motherboards. It's a 12-phase VRM, essentially running as a 6 plus 2, which gets doubled using the doublers on the back to get the 12 phases. Another thing that is noticeable right off the bat is that the rear i slash o does not have any video outputs, while it might be a letdown for some people. In all honesty, if you end up going for this motherboard, you are probably going to be using a dedicated video card with its video output so that should not be that big of a problem. However, due to the GPU shortage, if you are using integrated graphics, then you should stay away from this pick as there are no video outputs. Number 1. Asus TUF Gaming X570 PRO Wi-Fi 6 Asus TUF Gaming X570 PRO is one of the cheaper X570 motherboards for the Ryzen 9 5950X with value for money features. It does have all of the features that could comfortably make use of most of Ryzen 9 5950X power. Moreover, it is even possible to overclock the 5950X on Asus TUF Gaming X5 170 PRO. The motherboard also includes Wi-Fi 6 connectivity along with Bluetooth 5.1, which is always a plus, especially in this price category. One thing that stood out was the fact that it supports RAM speeds up to 5100 ms. Along with that, the Asus TUF Gaming X5 170 PRO CPU VRM delivers 12 phase 50, a power which should be enough for supporting the Ryzen 9 5950X. Because of the heatsink, the Asus TUF Gaming X 570 PRO manages to maintain stable VRM temperatures even under heavy load. It has a decent rear i/o with 4x USB 3.2 Gen 1, 3x USB 3.2 Gen 2. The motherboard contains a total of 8 SATA 6 GB S ports and two PCI Express 4.0 x16 slots. A total of six fan headers are provided, and the fan speed can be controlled in the BIOS. So guys, that's all for the top 7 best motherboard for Ryzen 9 5950X in 2022. The links of all products are given in the description, which are updated for the best prices. Subscribe our channel for more videos. We will meet in next video till then take care bye.